Hello there, internet dwellers. Welcome back to another video. Today, we are reacting to the Mandela Catalog Volume 5 by Alex Kister. It's been a while since we watched a Mandela Catalog video. I forgot when the last one was released. Volume 4 was released over a year ago, which is absolutely crazy. Now, there are parts of this story that I've completely forgotten about, but will probably be reminded of as I'm watching this. I do know the gist of it. It's about these people known as alternates who look like people, but aren't actually people. There's characters that obviously come into play. There's like a cup. There's a VHS owner. There's Gabriel the angel who turns out to be an alternate. There's a lot of moving parts going on, but we're going to do our best to watch this and try and remember the story and piece it together as we go along. So if you guys enjoy this, be sure to go subscribe to Alex Kister. Leave a like rating, subscribe, all that good stuff. If you enjoy my reaction, why not leave a like rating down below, subscribe. Oh, before the video actually begins, I need to address something from the last video. A lot of people seem to be commenting that I looked like crap and I looked beaten up. A lot of you are saying that you think something's wrong with me. I recorded that video an hour after waking up. So yeah, naturally I look tired. Don't worry, everything's okay. I'm hoping I look better now. Unfortunately, this is just how I look. So I, I can assure you that everything's okay. I'm good. But yeah, we're gonna jump into this video. Mandela Catalog Volume 5. There's nothing in the description except the people that were involved and the makeshift, makeshift plushy. Uh, here's all the voice actors involved. And let's jump into this. Here we go. AlexKister.net. Is that an actual thing? Oh, get rid of this. We're in indirected by Alex Kister. I'm going to open up an energy drink here and we're going to really get into this. Captions aren't good. Does this man resemble anyone you know by chance? I have never seen anyone in my life that looks anything like him. Got a long ass neck. Is this, I don't know if this is. I don't know if this is, I've said this before. I think this is a, the song that's being used here. It was probably used in another video by Alex. But is it about, is it the story of that guy who had, who was castrated? Not castrated himself, but was castrated to sing higher. And let's be honest. There are people out there who still have their balls who can sing higher than this. So was it really worth it? I don't know if that's true. I don't know how true that is, but I know there's a story about that. Okay, so someone's obviously been um, killed by an alternate here. Oh, hey, 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 don't skip ahead. What just happened there? Dropped a pen on the keyboard and it just decided to skip. It's very um, skinnamarink type of filming here. Okay, so it's coming back to me. There was paranormal investigators one of them was called Jonah, and I think Jonah himself ended up being an alternate. And Jonah's friend ended up being consumed by an alternate. Okay, there's Murray. That rings a bell. It's filmed really weird. It's filmed like Clerks, or like, like a weird uh, like green screen film. So I'm guessing we're still in the the ranch, the or the farm. Was it was it a farm at the start? Okay, United States Department of Temporal Phenomena, private exhi exhibition only. Established in 1981. Operation Census. 28 USDTP agents are stationed in Yonder County. Uh, is that Wisconsin? Win, 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 Jesus, what is going on with me? Wisconsin. Wis, 
Yeah, it is. Wiz constant. Why does that sound weird? To collect data regarding temporal bleeding in Mandela catalog. Temporal bleeding? What the hell does that mean? What the heck, bro? Notable events and oddities. Operation Census. Event 1. An unregistered vehicle, 1989 Ford Taurus, passes through Mandela Yonder County border numerous times within 11 days. Okay. This is in 1992. There's a person in this called Thatcher, right? And was that a police officer? that how fast is this car going it's going like 10 miles per hour despite numerous video captures of the vehicle it was never captured returning from the other direction okay well that means they're inside then right Agent Jay Booker fulfills his task of collecting adequate samples from the home of Nicholas Beringer, location of interest. During the scouting phase of the investigation, Booker accounted for several anomalies in, an, in or around the home. What are these anomalies? It's like I'm on observation duty. A limited amount of photo photographic evidence was captured of one such anomaly. Booker captured two photos and one video. Oh, good lord. <laughs> yeah, get off my property. Oh, man, this isn't looking good. So this house has been overrun with alternates. They're living among us, guys. And yes, I just said among us. In 2024. So this is a video. Bro, what, you, what were you recording with? Agent Booker's interpretation. How do you know Agent Booker hasn't been uh, compromised? Booker's interpretations of the unaccounted anomalies seen within the home are as follows. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. Well, that kind of looks normal. You know what that looks like? That looks like, you know, those like people who like old people who go in for that. There's a certain surgeon who like really messes up their face and makes them look weird and like they pull their skin back like this and you know you know what i'm talking about you might have seen them on like tiktok or instagram and they just look they don't even look human anymore it's, that's what that looks like booker reports that the anomalies were not aggressive only observant Are the kids too much? Boss won't give you that raise. Got skeletons in the closet. Beginner new. Midwestern Relocation Services. 1-800-SET-FREE, Indiana, Illinois. Wisconsin, Michigan. Okay. That reminds me of uh, that series we watched on the religious one, right? Highway 368 between exits 81 and 82, there is a small patch of empty space in the cornfield heading westbound. Pack your car in the nearby ditch and leave your keys in the glove box. Take any other valuable items with you. The empty space in the cornfield is the beginning of a path that eventually led, leads you to a large open plain. You will see a structure in the center of this plain. This is your safe house that you must remain within until you are relocated. Okay, so, oh, okay, so these people are relocating people who maybe, it's like the w witness protection, but from alternates. So is this uh, Agent Booker? Or, or, or am I, uh, okay, I'll, I'll just shut up for now, I'll stop making guesses. In 
in the middle of nowhere. The back door will be unlocked. My god, this is like 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 an FMV. It's shot like an FMV. We need more FMVs, guys. They're such unique games, especially horrors. Hello. This reminds me of the uh Oh, what was that uh, game called? 12 hours or something like that? 12 minutes, that's the one, with, um, you know, James McAvoy and Willem Dafoe. This is a very cozy house, isn't it? In New York, this would cost you like 5,000 a month. Doesn't even have a toilet as well, you know. Toilets are luxury in New York. shots. Ooh, jeez. That's kind of scary. Do you reckon this is like a special Airbnb somewhere? I'm just going to stop ruining immersion. Oh, wow. This looks like he's staying in a shed. Why would you have a TV there? Do doesn't the intruder come in through TVs? Bro, disconnect that thing. Stone Mountain, a white dynamite. Kids even climb into the driver's seat of the big machines they love. Your kids will ask for this video again. This is very Skinnamarink. Well, to be fair, no, this is a, like it shows a lot more than Skinnamarink does. Skinnamarink, you're just looking at walls for like an hour and 20 minutes or however long that absolute disaster of a film is. Heard something you wish you didn't? Do you find yourself constantly held back by irrational fear? Maybe you saw something you can't forget. Now, there is a solution. A new benzodiazepine with a modern approach to anxiety. Timoril. Okay. Timoril targets anxiety by calming the nervous system and slowing down hyperactivity in the brain. I'm confused. Is this still Symptoms the... such as insomnia, intrusive thoughts, and irrational fear are treated as a result, allowing you to live life the way you're supposed to. Okay. Timoril can cause serious side effects, including dizziness, hallucinations, confusion, impaired judgment, uncontrolled body movements, and headaches. What is it with American, like in England, you don't really, you, you have cold and flu tablet medicine, like adverts, that's it. But in America, I, I guess you just have free will to advertise any medication you want. And the side effects are always like, I don't understand, like they're always tragic. May cause anxiety, depression, thoughts of suicide. You may be a psychotic. You may run around naked. This has given me more of a headache. Worsening of anxiety or depression has been reported by some patients. Use caution while driving. Worsening, they said. So you take a pill to worsen your symptoms. Driving or operating machinery. You are not alone. Big farmer take in America, man. Today. It's crazy. Ask your man. healthcare provider about Timoral Farazepam. America's just a business, man. That's what that's, I mean, I guess. What the hell is this? Bit of stop claymation? It's a sheep. It's a dead sheep. The sheep the man. I tried my hardest. Yeah. I am sorry. What do you mean? Please forgive me. For what? What are you, what are you about to do, buddy? You. It's Gabriel. You are the Holy Spirit. You spoke to me. And now I am here. Okay. You spoke to me and now am I'm here. Am I forgiven? For what? 
my... Oh, the sheep's alive now. Is that real sheep? So yeah, I forgot that the uh, the Mandela catalog kind of took an artistic turn. I mean, there are stories being told here, but it's told in such an artistic way. And I guess I'm just not really Jim? clever. Hey. You made it safely? Yeah. Bro, what? Okay. I mean... I mean, here's the thing. This is an artistic choice, right? To have it filmed like this. Like, it's it's meant to look weird, right? But I don't know. It's just... Got I guess it's I guess it's meant to be uncanny and unnatural. And I guess that's the style that Alex decided to go with. But it completely throws me out. I'll, I'll be honest. You'll be there at 430 sharp in the Silver Fort Doors. Silver Fort Doors. Okay. So he's going to be relocated. This is your last chance to tell me you don't want this. It's like the Hoover guy back once you step into that car. from Breaking Bad. I do want this. You have to pay 50 grand and you'll disappear. All right. 50 grand to disappear is not that bad, honestly. Nice village in British Columbia. I think you'll like it. Listen. Now's the time to start making your calls. People mm. noticing your absence too soon will fuck up this whole operation. I'll take care of it. Okay. This operation, what's going on? Dr. Williamson speaking. Hey, it's Jude. Jude Murray. Oh, Mr. Murray. How are you? I'm... I'm good. I'm great. Uh, how are you? Oh, you know. Just pushing through. Tell me, how is little Adam holding up? Any improvements? Adam? Yeah, he's... He's doing great. Fantastic. Adam was the, the, the kid, right? Well. So is this the dad of Adam? Because Adam's mum hung herself, right? When would you like to get him in next? Uh, well, that's the thing. Uh, Lynn and I finally closed on that house. You know, the one where it's at the little ranch. And uh, we're, we'll, we'll be uh, moving doctors. We'll be, uh, we'll be moving. <laughs> Bro, you could not sound... Any more unconvincing. We'll, we'll, we'll be, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll be, <laughs> goodbye. That is just great. Just keep me updated. I'll be able to transfer your prescription in no problem. I'm proud of you. For, <laughs> you know, taking initiative for their safety. I knew you could do it. It'll be all right. Taking initiative for their safety. That's such a strange house. In the middle of nowhere as well, it's crazy. Clock's going slow, or is it? No? Okay. That is a steep staircase. If you fall down that, you're, you're certainly going to die. Well, to be fair, if you fall down, you'd probably, like, you, the length of your body would... Oh, actually, no, never mind. That would hurt a lot. Look how steep that is, especially in the night. Get this... Why have I got a pen in my hand? Oh, wait, is someone there? Turn on the light, man. Have they found you? Are you compromised? Oh, the clock stopped. Okay, 
there's flashes of the I think that was of his sheep Hello? that he thought to be dead. Hello. Hello. Are you the shepherd? Yes. Who are you? I'm Jane. I'm the farmer. I was wondering if you had any spare grains from your sheep. Grains. You're a farmer with no grains. My... my crops were ruined. What by? This is a fever dream. So uh, these, these, these volumes I get... I will pay you back in time, I assure you. Okay. What is the matter? It's very Team America. You know animals, don't you? What is the matter with my little one? Oh my, it is beautiful, my friend. You are truly blessed. What do you mean? It is clearly not healthy. Well, what do I know? Clearly not I am healthy. no shepherd after all. I must get back to work. Is it because it looks real? Shepherd! Come visit me tonight. I'd love for you to see my animals. Oh, I bet you better stop it. Stop. You know, everything's a euphemism. Why me? Did he say why me? Literally, like that's just like every 70 year old. That's Joe Biden, basically, when he goes to climb some stairs. Ah, oh, he's been freaking, he's been chained to the ground with a ball, ball and chain, as they say. How do I know you are holy? Hello? Jude? How do I know you're holy? Hello? You, know I mean? you there, buddy? Yeah, I'm, I'm here. I just arrived at your new place. It is beautiful up here. How long have you been on the road? How's the driver? Is he well behaved? The driver? Isn't it exciting? This is the escape you've been waiting for. And it's finally happening. So what's he escaping from? His family? Where are you, Jude? I couldn't. Couldn't huh? not. Could you speak up a little? I'm, I'm not in the car. You're not in the car? He couldn't. I, um, what the hell happened? Did, did you forget you were being picked up? No, 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 no. Listen. I didn't forget. I... I didn't just couldn't. Go. You couldn't what? Use your words. Use your words. There was someone at the door. Judas Mur is that Murphy? I, I couldn't leave. Judas Mur. What the fuck? Judas. Okay, so there's a lot of like there's a lot of religious kind of references in this. So we got Judas here. Judas, as you know, in the stories, betrays Jesus. And the this, Oh, okay. And okay, so Adam was Judas's son. What was the mum's name again? I completely forgot. But I believe Adam gets with a girl called eve uh he's ends up being an alternate i forgot what happened to him i think a police officer actually went into his room was he shot i can't remember something happened but yeah there's a lot of biblical references going on so judas is obviously betrayed and in this sense i'm guessing he's betrayed his family by trying to escape okay, right your problem do you have any idea how many hours he drove to get you two what about how long two hours <laughs> An entire community of the kindest people I know were ready to welcome you. They were so excited to meet you, Jude. Jack now Williamson. Now I have to send them all home, disappointed. MD. But you know that feeling all too well, don't you? Filthy deadbeat. You can't escape this. What's he done? Why is he you escaping? What? But you did. What did he do? Stop acting like it didn't happen, Jude. Jude, what happened? Come on, mate. Do Come what on. you need to do. Do what you need to do. Do the world a favor. <laughs> you know that? Is it June? 
with um, Austin Butler. Is it Austin Butler? Is that his name? His character. What do we do? Okay, so is that the driver there or someone else? It's a shadow. Can I help you? Hi, Lieutenant Davis, MCPD. Lieutenant Davis. Um, we didn't call for the police. Every, every, everything's okay here. We're just doing routine check. Bro, you could be a little less suspicious with the whole, like, looking through the door like that. Town. It's a requirement from the state. Then again, is this person even real? Is this another alternate? Because I know that the police department, I think, was infiltrated with alternates. But I don't know if that's after this or before this or during this. From somewhere? I don't think so. Oh, camera's about to die. Is this MCPD's jurisdiction? Yes. Oh, I, I guess we're still in Mandela. Thought we were in Yonder. Um, can I help you with anything? Are you aware of the television of your destruction order? Television destruction order? Well, I, um, I'm, I'm house sitting and, uh, yeah, I'm aware of it, but we're all good here. Good. Okay. Always nice to meet another upstanding citizen. I hope you and your family have a nice day. Bro, that Thanks, is not a person. Officer. That is definitely not a person. He's going to come back later on and mutilate you. Hey, Judas, why are you running from your family? From what I remember... Northern Missouri and dotted across the Dakotas into northern Minnesota. Just a little bit of light rain. Occasional storms starting to build in Arizona, too. Oh, my God. So jazzy. What actually, would you call that jazz? It's 10 p.m. Do you know where your children are? Do you know where your children are? What? Avoid unpleasant surprises when you travel. Do you know where your children are? Adam was kidnapped, right? And that was a kind of like a dig at this guy almost. To be like, where is your child? Because the mum hung herself, I believe. So the dad... Did, was that before or after the dad left? What? This is how every man sleeps, guys. Like, when they get an apartment first. This is it. This is the room. TV, bed on the floor. You know, it doesn't get better than that. I think it took me a couple of months before I actually got, an, uh, like, a bed frame. <laughs> TV, PlayStation, or Xbox. Or if you... supposed to be here, did Dad just say? Oh, widened eyes. Is someone there looking over him? Oh god, what are we gonna see? It's supposed to be you. Okay, so I'm guessing this is in reference to the son being kidnapped. Right? Captured. From the, by the stranger in the TV. So why wasn't he there? This sleep paralysis. Something going to appear on the left there. Yeah. It's caressing the door. Oh, he's probably. What, what are you doing there, buddy? Like that. I don't like how quick that was. And there were shepherds living out in the fields nearby, keeping watch over their flocks at night. Night fell upon them in an instant, and all the color was drained from the world. 
an angel appeared to them, and they were terrified. The angel fooled them, just like he planned. But there was more work to be done. Right. It does not need to be that way. You are not the first. There are so many more. Nothing has been done yet. He has a lot of convincing to do. Until then, trust nobody. Are you listening to me? Trust Are you nobody. listening to me? Are you listening to me? Yeah, I'll trust nobody, man. Where, where am I? What do you mean? You're in my home. Uh-oh. You've been here for a He's while. He's here. What? I know his presence. Who's hey. he? Everybody left town. It's just you and me. Just mm -hmm. what I prayed for. Right. Look at me. What's wrong? Oh, God, what was that? What's Go wrong? Go back. Please. Ugh. That's Gabriel, right? Oh dear. What is that? What happened? Bro isn't even on the mattress anymore. That cannot be comfy. The TV off? Or on? Oh, that's his house. That's that window right here. Well, that's pretty disturbing. It's so quiet. You just know something loud's about to happen. Oh God, I'm not turning up my volume. I know it's completely fine. What is that? That's a baby. Is that his son? Being haunted by his past, maybe. Okay. We'll have a look in the comments after this, guys. We'll have a little... There's people in there that are a lot cleverer than me and remember the story as it's told. There's so many, like, different elements to this story, though, that's going on, so it's hard to piece it all together. Ugh. Uh, that's not fun. You know, when I said that police officer was going to come back later on and mutilate him, I was only half joking. Right, you need some, you need an inhaler or something. Oh, there was someone in the doorway there. Bro, why is the door open? There's no way this man left his door open. Oh, they stood there. That's slow motion.
soundtrack's good. You can tell a lot, a lot of work what went you into this. It's you! It's fucking you! What the fuck do you want from me? You've taken everything from me! You've taken my wife! You've taken my fucking child! Okay. What do you, you want to kill me? Fucking kill me! I've got nothing! Oh dear. Oh dearie, 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 dearie. What's happened? Why is it like slow frames all of a sudden? Is that meant to be the TV? that someone hanging outside who is that or oh, is it this this is the stranger right God, that's an odd-looking guy right there. Who is hanging outside? Please. Someone. Please. Okay, in the story, Judas, in the story, doesn't he feel super guilty about selling Jesus out and he ends up hanging himself on a tree, right? Is he overdosing? What's going on? <laughs> He's inside my mind. He's inside my mind. Stop it, please. Stop, 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 please. So Zippy Doda says, that ending was horrifying. To me, it seems that the, the alternate taking advantage of the pills for its hallucination side effects is now putting Jude through a fate worse than death. Just constant visions of horror and taunting, taunting him with the vision of his own death, a freedom he'll probably never achieve now. Rainbowing the Ma Mare Productions, I think that's the name. Okay, so someone on Reddit suggested that the shepherd represents Jude, the family and the sheep that died and came back as Adam. Adam. I'm guessing what happened was these alternates or whoever was in the TV, the, the, the intruder, the stranger, whatever, whatever it's called, took the son and the mother in anguish, not knowing where the son is, hung herself. And now because a Judas here or Jude here thinks that he's gonna be next, he wants to move away. So he was meant to be going somewhere else. And this was meant to be like his temporary home before he's moved on. But for some reason, he decided he didn't want to move on. And because of that, he was eventually tracked down by this other alternate. Because we know that in the Mandela, the Mandela County Police Department, that's been infiltrated with alternates. And it's something about this family, I guess, that the alternates are after. And now Jude is suffering with like anxiety, depression, obviously all this like paranoia and stuff like that for right, the right reasons. Obviously, his family has been taken away from him, basically, and he thinks he's next. But these pills make it a lot worse, like they sometimes make it even worse than it actually is. Someone said the alternates are probably taking advantage of that and just like making him suffer. Not sure why, I don't know what the whole, the goal of these alternates is, I'm guessing just to spread, unleash how, I'm guessing, because they're not holy, 
they're the opposite of holy. Yeah, there's a lot of backstory to this, guys. There was three volumes before this one, and most of those were pretty, and, and the little episodes in between, and um, they're filled with information on new stuff, new characters, and it's hard to remember all of that. Obviously, I, I've taken it for what it is, it was very well shot, very artistically made, for sure. Like, the vision, the, like, the, the artistic style that Alex chose to go with is very unique for sure. Very claustrophobic way of shooting things. And I think that's done on purpose to make you feel trapped in there with this Jude character. You know, this feeling of like being isolated on your own. I think that really kind of is painted here for sure. But let me know your theories down below, guys. Obviously, there's a lot that I've misremembered or maybe completely forgotten about that would make this make more sense. But I would love to hear your theories for sure. So guys, be sure to go subscribe to Alex Kister. Leave a like rating, all that good stuff. If you enjoyed my reaction video, when well, I leave a like rating, subscribe. I hope you guys did enjoy. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care, guys.